Good morning, John Glenn. Today, I'm Major Plunkett, and this is the view from the Falcon's Nest. Today is Wednesday, May 24th, 2023. A group of Walkerton students had a blast learning science on Tuesday. According to WNDU, the students were out launching rockets as a part of a culmination of a project started in the fall. Rocket scientist Mike Dressen visited and taught the history of NASA and how a aero aeronautics came to be. The project was a part of Walkerton's high ability student group. A major economic development project may happen near John Glenn. The South Bend Tribune is reporting that General Motors will likely have to decide soon whether to pr proceed with an EV battery plant that it's, that it's been considered considering for ag agricultural land east of New Carli Carlisle since last year. Tuesday, uh, county of county officials approved a development agreement and a $332 million abatement package for the project, which GM plans to build with Samsung SDI. Most of the paperwork was completed la late last year, but it had to be rein reinitiated because LG Energy Solution was GM's original partner on the project. GM and LG already have three three such EV battery plants completed on or underway in Ohio, Michigan, and Tennessee. But when the two couldn't come to an agreement on a fourth plant, GM decided to move forward with Samsung. Seniors, if you are going to college and you haven't seen your picture on the wall outside of the guidance office, that means you still need to complete a Google form sent from Ms. Hudgens called Senior College Commitment. See your counselor if you need help finding this form. <coughs> Seniors, remember that you are expected to be here at school tomorrow by 9 a.m. to be to attend the awards assembly and mandatory graduation practice. Breakfast will be served at the beginning, at the beginning at 8:30. If any of your relatives slash guests need ground level seating for graduation, you need to contact Miss Parrish in the main office immediately to arrange this. This is the final week for seniors to purchase the friendship. John Glenn's yearbook for the discounted price of $43. Underclassmen can still purchase a yearbook for $46 or for families with two or more students, $40 per yearbook. Checks or cash can be dropped in room 406. And now, here's weather with Aiden. Good morning, Falcons. Today is gonna be sunny with a real feel of 57. It's gonna actually be 83 though, now of the three day. Wednesday, it's gonna be 80 sunny with a low of 53. Thursday, it's going to be 70, sunny with a low of 43. And Friday, it's going to be 76, sunny with a low of 43. Now, here's sports with Nathan. Good morning, Falcons. The Lady Falcons softball team came to an end last night. The host Kankakee Valley Cougars eliminated Glenn from the sectional with an 11-1 11, 11 defeat. Many good things happened for the girls this year, and we can look forward for greater things in 2024. The Glenn baseball team has moved up two spots in the latest prep ba baseball report rankings for Class 3A. Coach John Nadoni's team is number eight this week. Garen Catholic is number one, followed by Jasper, Western, Gary Andrean, West Vigo, Evansville Memorial, and Hanover Central. Rounding out the top ten behind Glenn are Silver Creek and Fairfield. That's all for sports, not a lunch with Aiden. Today for lunch, we're going to be having beef taco, cook's choice, refried beans, golden corn, variety of fresh fruit, and Spanish rice.